All right, well, thank you guys very much for stopping by in Comic-Con International. We got a lot of fan questions, because of course you know your show has a lot of fans. So um, I'm just going to fire them off at you. Okay. Becca, Matias, and Leah want to know if Tom Welling will be directing this season. Yes, he, he is. He's yes. slated. I, I can't remember episode, what episode, but yes. I believe episode 16, 16. at the moment, uh -huh. but sometimes that switches up when you cast and right, the right, crew right. changes. Uh, it happened to the schedule, but uh -huh. look for it at 16. Awesome, awesome. We're excited to have Alice and Mac hopefully. I was just going to say that. Yeah, we weren't able to go work. to the panel because yeah. we were back here, but I heard that. Who sealed that deal? Um, it's been in the works for, for quite a while. So but I heard there was a handshake. So you guys handshake, are going to be helping so that. No, we, we want her yeah. to direct so badly. So yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah, it didn't happen last season, right? Well, the, the writer's strike a few right. things right. off. But. Right, right. All right, Cassandra and Paul want to know if there will be a good resolution to the Clark and Lana thing since they broke up. I know. Well, that. she will be coming back, all right, which is all great, right, yes. and it's not going to be quite the Lana that we all knew. Um, oh, she's, you know, she's taking a little bit of a hiatus, taking a, taking a little trip away, so okay. she's going to come back a little, a little slightly changed. A little meteor freaky, maybe. Uh, I'm not no? sure about that. Okay, but Clark, right. will, have, still, Clark okay. will have a few women in his life this year, so. Oh. God, you guys make this job so rough. Huh? <laughs> but first loves are first loves. Yeah, that's true. It's that's hard true. To deny that. Now, have you guys gotten any flack about the whole Lois and Clark thing? That that was the real original story and. Well, you're going to see a lot of Lois and Clark this season. You got it. Yeah. All right. So we're going to get back to those. Yeah. Roots. We're, 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 oh, we're heading down toward the uh, Superman mythology uh -huh, uh -huh. that uh, we all know and love. So. Yeah. Clark yeah. yeah. is taking a job at the Daily Planet. Oh, this all right. Year. right so right. Clark and Lois at the Daily Planet uh -huh, is uh -huh. going to be a huge part of the season. And the sparks and the friction Is he going to sport the glasses? <laughs> we'll see. All right. <laughs> Too many fans to mention their names want to know if uh, Clark accepts his destiny finally in this season. And, that, well, and, that's part of going to the Daily Planet for him, is that okay. he realized, like, hanging out in Smallville, yes, there are crypto villains out there and a lot of people to save, but mm -hmm. it's a small town in Kansas After at the end of the day. Yeah, and there right, are a lot yeah. more people out in the world that need him. Uh -huh. So when he goes to the Daily Planet, uh -huh. he's, like, he's getting his, uh, you know, the police reports and uh -huh, everything, uh -huh. so he's really in the middle, in the thick of it. Got it. Got and uh, what we can promise is he's going to start accepting his double identity and exploring the double identity. Okay, okay. So yeah, yeah. A lots of, of thick uh, plot lines with that, too, right? All right, this question came in from Carrie in all caps. Thank you, Carrie. Where is Lex? Uh, wouldn't everyone love to know? <laughs> but there's one person who has come to find him, and that is Tess Mercer, our new character. Uh -huh, and uh -huh. she is a force to be reckoned with in looking for Lex Luthor. All right, all right. And you're not going to leak anything? No, that Maybe was you know, good. maybe you don't. Yeah. yeah, that was a good way around that question. Um, Astrogena? Astrogena? All right. Kara, Kara, is she rescued from the Phantom Zone? Uh, we're working on something right now to bring Kara into the show for an episode. So, for an episode? For an episode at least. Oh, so we'll see. We oh, love her. Yeah. But you can't stay trapped in the Phantom Zone forever. We'll right, just this say is that. true. This is true. <laughs> All right. I uh, heard some rumors, and Isabel also did, about a Supergirl spinoff. Is there, uh, is there any truth to that? That would be fantastic. Can yeah. we write it? Do you know more than we, you know more than I'm we pitching do. it to you. <laughs> no, Isabel wants to know. Actually, she heard it somewhere on some blogs or something. I, Nothing, no truth, no, no I don't. I, I don't know. I can't confirm that. I, have not, I don't have that tidbit of information, but that would be fantastic. All right. I think there are a, a lot of DC characters that are worthy of their own shows, okay. and so hopefully we want Marvel to continue. After that, or at the same time, we would love to see a show with another superhero. So. Okay, all right. And last one, Jamie, thank you, Jamie, wants to know what uh, super powers Chloe is going to acquire. How, how do her powers grow? Ooh, her, they don't uh. just grow. <laughs> they kind of, yeah. She has a rough year this year, I have really? to tell you. Yeah, oh, she, poor her, Allison. I know, she has some, some powers that kind of take a back seat and then some others that kind of take a front seat and don't well, you guys gave her a power that almost know. killed her the first the last season so i mean how much this all i can say is this power won't kill her okay might kill her good spirit maybe, maybe. might have some oh, ramifications for other people all right all right <laughs> You got a, anything uh, to say over there? That was it. That was <laughs> Tight it. lips? Okay. All right. Well, thank you guys thank very you. much. Thank you. Uh, Absolutely. Great time.